Hey, Steve Zook here. Welcome back to uh, <coughs> Poke Sue channel or wherever you happen to be seeing this. This is really a rare guitar. It really has a sound too. <coughs> most guitars are very weak in the bass and the mid bass. And, uh, you know, while most older made in Japan guitars from the 70s and 80s sound really good, some sound better. Some have more uh, mid range and mid bass, which is an area of weakness for most guitars. But the Japanese know a lot of secrets to making guitars. But uh, this guitar just really has beautiful, beautiful orchestral range, really nice mids and mid bass. not going to see one of these advertised on Craigslist or anywhere for probably quite a while so if you're interested my suggestion is uh, hit me up it really has a sound I'm really cold it's hard to play it when I'm not warmed up I put some new strings on this, so... I just uh, putting this on Craigslist this morning. And I'm in Dad Gad. you can tell. But here how it has that warm tone but still it doesn't have a compressed bass or mid bass. And the flame maple really adds to that. It's almost like a parametric EQ. You can actually see the flame inside the guitar if you look. I'm not sure if you have enough light to show that. But yeah this this has got flame maple sides back solid top. It's, it really has a sound. So anyway, just wanted to do a short demo. Yes, I love this guitar. Yeah, the Japanese know a lot of secrets to making guitars, so, you know, like I said, most people know most of the great, you know, guitars from the 70s and early 80s really have a sound, but some sound even better, and uh, a lot of people don't realize that the, that the flame maple really brings out a, a beautiful pop and a, uh, brings out a lot of overtones and kind of a pianistic quality. This guitar reminds me of a great Martin that meets maybe a great Yari. <laughs> It's just got an absolutely gorgeous mid-range.
miss this guitar, but I have a friend offering to sell me a really, really nice vintage jazz box. A lot of money, but still a really, really great price for what it is. I can't refuse. This is a guitar that was in my collection. But no more. It's, it's, I gotta say goodbye. So I hope it goes to somebody who appreciates it. And I'm not just saying that. I really, I really love this guitar. I'm not sure if this mic is close enough to hear it. Probably is. play this guitar the more I'm almost talking myself out of selling it so I'm gonna quit playing it but I just wanted you to hear it really these, these are pretty new strings and I, I haven't played this guitar much recently see it's got that great Yari sound but it's also got that woody mid-range Martin wooden bell sound I've owned other Ibanez guitars with highly figured wood, and um, they they don't have this kind of sound. They they don't have this strong mid bass, bass and mid range and, and great treble too. They're they're not as or you know the orchestral balance isn't as strong. So uh, you know, um, this this one has has the mojo and really has a sound. It's a lot of guitar for what I'll let it go for you know today and the next couple of days. It's probably gonna go pretty quick. But yeah, this is really, really a sweet guitar. Plays nice too. All right, take care. 714-548-0385. 714-548-0385. I'll let this go for four ninety nine today. Yeah, it's a it's a it's a hell of a box. All right, see you.